Hey everyone, today we get to play on Braxis Holdout. Looks like we are the fourth pick, so we do get to fill in for our team a little bit. Um, looks like the first two picks that our team is hovering is Gazlo and Sergeant Hammer. I do believe Sergeant Hammer was just reworked and released today. Uh, she is very good and can do a lot of damage. It looks like the enemy team has gotten rid of the Kael'thas. So what we need is we do need to get a tank and a healer. Uh, first we are going to be banning out Garrosh, which is good, especially against the hammer. Uh, they are going to first pick Dahaka. Let's see what we go ahead and pick to counter. Looks like we've picked up Gazlo, who I do believe loses the lane to Dahaka. Let's see what Ghost Cross picks up. Hopefully he understands that we need a healer and a tank. All right, he has picked up Rhaegar as our healer. And it does look like um, Dr. 2C is picking up our tank in uh, Muradin. So now that leaves me with the options of um, another damage dealer. Uh, like I can, I can guess I can go burst damage. Interesting. We have a lot of options here. Uh, I do like a mage. Mage for the burst. You can try Li Ming or Chromie. Do we need anything that has stacks? Because there's two frontliners. I you know I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the uh see stick with Li Ming. Range Assassin, I do like Yeah. I do like the um Sergeant Hammer. A lot of auto attack damage. Very bursty. Not bursty, very sustained. And mine's very burst. Yep. We are gonna go with Li Ming here. Uh talents. We might just go with a ore build. Um, uh, looks like they did pick up Kel'Thuzad, uh, which does counter the uh, um. Uh, the hammer as uh, he does need to land skill shots and she doesn't move Ready for action. Uh, I would disagree with it does like so much damage Um, oh wait, so the car they picked up the Kerrigan, which is also another, um, another counter to Hammer, as soon as she sieges up. I don't know. We'll see how well our Hammer does. Um, she now can get graduating range at level 7. Um... I think level 1, she can get a talent that allows her to do 40% more damage. We'll see what uh, what kind of build they go. Um, I think I should probably get the Force Missiles Grant spell armor, especially against the Kel'Thuzad. 
Yeah, we are going to go with Force Armor here. So, we're not going to go with the uh, Orb build. We are just going to go with um, a regular standard build. So, Force Armor. Then we're going to go with Dominance. We're going to go with Calamity. Um, we can go Wave of Force. Then we will go with... Uh, Illusionist, I think. And then we will go with Mirror Ball. And then finally... Um, Repulsion. Alright. Okay. We are <laughs> sieging up here. Not sure why they're allowing us to siege up, but they are. Does look like the Rhaegar was taken down. And the Rhaegar was, or sorry, not the Rhaegar. The um, hammer was taken down. You're just gonna keep poking at them. Okay. Looks like I'm by myself here. Which is never what you want as a Li Ming. But we were able to get the top. Okay. Uh, let's go with Dominance. There we go. Um, the top lane is getting pushed in. They're almost not worth it. <laughs> fine. But they should be fine. It is level five to level uh, four here. All right, now the bright wing is down. Let's say we are just sieging up here. Um, I am just gonna quickly grab this glow for the mana. And Why not? does look like the uh, Gazla was taken down. Um, Okay, I think we're doing all right. We're just poking. Time to make my retreat. Select a talent. Uh, we are just gonna go back and get mana. Flamity here. Defeated. 
All right. I'm just going to go up try to help out this Rhaegar. Okay. Uh, with us leaving the bottom lane, uh, it does look like... I'll just reposition there. Well, I think we're doing okay, like personally, but the uh, the friendly team is definitely getting caught out way too much. Okay, so we do see our team comp and what they lack, which is wave clear. Although, the Rhaegar does offer some. Okay. We are going to go down and help out the Gazlo. Uh, we are going to go with Wave of Force here. Continuously get more and more mana. Hmm, okay. Okay. Uh, it does look like the Sergeant Hammer was able to take out the Kerrigan. Perfect. All right, we'll just take that. Uh, the Gaslo should just go and grab that. As he is our best person to take mercenary camps. Looks like he does not want to do that. He just wants to sit here in lane. Okay. But we were able to get the fort, so that's not terrible. Uh, we'll just quickly grab this. And we'll rotate away. Let's make sure that we... Okay. Uh, that was a little disappointing from the friendly team. So while this is happening, we are losing the objective. I'm just going to quickly go up here and grab this. Just to stop the channel, not to do anything besides that. Alright. Uh... I would not say I would not say that at all. Uh 
That was a good ancestral. Okay. We're going to increase teleport range here. We ought to capture this mercenary camp. Does look like Sergeant Hammer wants to capture the mercenary camp as they only have six seconds left. Do we have a Robo uh, Gazza? We do. Excellent. Here we go. Okay. And I do agree with um, Ghost Cross here is that we were just to get lucky they weren't paying attention. Um. Okay. I must heal. Uh, if I didn't screw up, that would probably would have done a lot better. But I did screw up, so. Okay. It seems like my travels never end. Uh, well done by the Gaslow. I do like that a lot. Uh, hopefully Merdin doesn't throw it. Okay. are going to go with mirror ball here Okay. Well, we are slowly turning this around. Okay. Okay. 
You're just gonna keep on sieging up here. Sergeant Hammer is taking care of the Zerg wave. I am out of mana here, so hopefully the uh, friendly team knows that. Okay, uh, it's time for me to run. If this were easy, everyone would do it. I'm just gonna swing down here, grab that. I'm just going to back all the way, actually. Get full, full mana. Does look like uh, the Gazlo is ensuring that they don't steal any or steal the boss. Just making sure. Okay, this is not a good idea. As we don't have anyone to. There we go. All right. Well, they threw. Well, you know, I said that I don't think that was a good idea. I am very, very, very wrong. Okay, well, that's nice to be wrong. Okay. There we go. Got ourselves. Oh dang. Alright. Time for me to run. I'm just gonna go right here. Uh, we do have our s storm shield or storm talents. So we are just going to take that. And while the boss is still pushing. Okay. There we go. Sweet. And it does look like... The uh, Muradin was able to get the kill on the Dahaka, so it does make our lives a little bit easier. I knew we could do this. Okay. Okay, well, we did lose that in the Gazlo. Okay, well, let's just go. It is a 5v4 right now. However, we were able to get a kill and the keep is now destroyed. There we go. Uh, 
I need some assistance. Thank you. All right. Wow. GG. That was very difficult. I still think the hammer did um, is a really good hero. Um, and uh, like especially after the rework, they like they are able to get a lot more damage out. But I think our guys was just got countered a little bit and goes caught out. Um, did do, um, yes, I'm going to vote for myself. Shameless, shameless and vote for myself, but, um, did do like a lot of damage to Zuri. Let's have a look to see, uh, what kind of, uh, we were slightly, or we were favored there. That's interesting. Let's look at the stats that we have for today. <laughs> Hammer was caught out eight times. So we had eight kills, 15 assists. So we tied the hammer. Uh, camera had 8 kills, 8 assists, 8 deaths. We did 69,614 in siege damage. The hammer did 122,222. Uh, hero damage, we did 79,456. Uh, the Gazla at 72. Sorry, hammer at 71. Uh, we did do the top XP contribution at 14,799. Uh, looks like we were able to kill the team pretty consistently. However, in most deaths is owned by the hammer. She was caught out a little bit, but that's fine. The talents we went for today were uh, Force Armor, Dominance, Calamity, Wave of Force, Illusionist, Mirror Ball, and finding Repulsion. So um, we were able to get a little bit, uh, like with Calamity, we were able to get um, some good kills, uh, some good resets. Uh, I was able to use the Repulsion... Um, once there to keep the uh, Kael'thuzad from running away. I uh, don't have much practice with the Li Ming, especially with the resets. So I could probably use a lot more practice there. But let me know what you guys think and what we could have done a little bit better. And have a great day.